where is the place for quantum computing in the AI workflows and actually vice, vice versa. Yeah. Um, so generally we see quantum computing not so much as a standalone technology, but actually the future of computing we see is going to be hybrid devices. So there will be a quantum computer, there will be a cluster of CPUs, GPUs, maybe other compute modalities like neuromorphic computing in the future. And then a kind of orchestration layer on the software side, which takes the big problem that you want to solve and then takes this part that runs well on a quantum computer and gives it to the quantum computer. It takes this part that runs well on a GPU cluster and, and put it there. And this is the way to think about, for example, let's say an AI workflow, um, that even in these AI problems, there are actually kind of sub-problems which are quite complex from a mathematical point of view. So for example, what quantum computers are good at is multiplying um, big matrices, so linear algebra. And usually you find these kind of problems in an AI um, problem. And this is where the quantum computers can help. So we have lots of ideas how quantum computers can actually accelerate AI um, calculations. But then it's also the other way around. So actually, to develop our quantum computers and also to run and operate our quantum computers, we use lots of machine learning technology, for example. And so from this perspective, it's a two-way street. So on the one hand side, quantum computers will help AI, but on the other side, already now, AI actually is helping quantum computing. And, and I think in this kind of synergy and, and playful way to do it together, both sides will benefit in the end.